Bring Geekonomics community. It's the 21st of January and today I want to bring to you a new concept which my uh, dear colleague and I, Mr Ridley, have come up with in the last day or two and basically it is an investigation into behavioural economics and it all stems from, does it not Mr Ridley, it all stems from uh, something which happened to you just in the beginning of September 2015. Would you like to explain to the the viewers and their hundreds of thousands uh, what happened exactly? Yes, thank you. Uh, good morning, uh, subscribers. I don't think we need to go into total details of uh, exactly what happened, but I was off work from an operation and uh, therefore stuck in the house and I needed assistance to get out of the house in for over a seven week period, which is when we started our investigation. investigation yes. And so <clears throat> our primary goal in this investigation uh, is to see how behavioural economics impacts you, the subscribers, and in order to do this, we have come up with quite a cunning uh, little project. I think you'll agree, Mr Ridley? Yes. yes, it's going well so far in our trial. And it actually involves, ladies and gentlemen, I know I didn't get a chance to do the Sunday Times review this week, but it actually involves something which is in this week's Sunday Times. I hope you can see that, viewers. And the headline here is, we found a winning recipe for burgers, just keep it simple. Now, in the last number of weeks, Mr. Ridley and I have been eating in a few establishments around the northeast area in Newcastle, and we don't even need to look any longer at the recipe, do we? we uh, not the recipe. We don't look at the recipe, do we? Hey, we don't need to look any more at the menu. Why yes. not, Mr. Ridley? Because what we do, we go in and order a simple burger. As the headline says, you, you know, you couldn't have coined it more perfectly, we go in, and go in and order a simple burger. And so in the next few weeks, viewers, in order for you to see the results of this investigation, you'll have to keep tuning in. We hope to have a regular update every Tuesday, possibly Wednesday morning, probably yeah. more likely. And... I think this is going to prove to be really interesting. If I may, just at this, just at this point, uh, say that my personal favourite so far has been uh, a place called The Gentleman. Um, two gentlemen, uh, obviously. We're going Pretty, in there. New Pretty new restaurant. Pretty new restaurant. Refurbished. Uh, always... Um, Plenty of room in it whenever we've gone in. So far, it does yes. surprise us a bit at the moment. It does surprise us, yes. We've been in twice, uh, or at least I've been with you twice, Mr. Ridley. That's, mm -hmm. that's the case. And in my opinion, their burgers so far have been tip top. Yes, indeed. The onion rings could be improved. Leave a little bit to be desired, but. I was thinking about this the other night, Mr. Ridley. Do we really want to get into assessing the sort of the side dishes as well as the burger, or do we just want to stick to the? It's an interesting point. Certainly, the burger, the gentleman, was the best. Yeah, well, it was absolutely fun. tremendous. So, ladies and gentlemen, keep viewing, keep watching. This is a new project, an interesting project, uh, we believe, and certainly something that's got some legs and some mileage. So. Uh, next Wednesday, that will be the 28th of uh, January, will be our first update. So look forward to getting back to you then, and uh, bye for now. Bye-bye.